Welcome to this tutorial. The topic of this tutorial is Class 1 Elementary Mathematics, Chapter 12, page number 68. Dear students, by seeing this class, you will be able to solve all the questions which is mentioned in page number 68. So, dear students, I hope you can see it is page number 68 of your Elementary Mathematics textbooks. Now, we will try to solve all the solu all the problems, all the questions which is mentioned here. At the top of this page, you can see the question is 9 plus 4. And the author of this book also mentioned 9 boxes here and 4 boxes here. So actually, it is mentioned here because by seeing these boxes, you can visualize the problem very gently. So, in your left hand side there has 9 and that's why you can see there has 9 boxes in your right side you can see there has 4 and that's why there has 4 boxes so now the question to you is that 9 plus 4 is equal what there we also can see there has a boy and there has a girl so the boy is saying that make a set of 10 blocks by adding 1 from 4 with 9. This girl is saying that remain 3 leaving 1 from 4. So actually if you want to solve this question you should try to solve the question step by step. So now you can see there has 9 but if you want to make this 9 10 I mean, if you want to turn this 9 into 10, you need one block. That means there has 9 blocks. But if you want to make it 10, you need one block. On the other hand, you can see there has 4 block. If you split this 4, if you split this 4, you can see there will be one box and there will be three box. So, this one you can add with that 9. And finally, 9 plus 1 will be 10. And that's why you can see there has 10 blocks. And at last there will be available these 3 boxes. And these 3 boxes are present there. So finally, 10 plus 3 is equal to what? It's very easy. And you know that 10 plus 3 is equal to 13. So ultimately you can say that 9 plus 4 is equal to 13. So actually that's the procedure of this problem. So actually, in this class, we will try to solve all these steps uh, very uh, easily so that you can understand the problem. So now, we will just try to read that what it is written here. So now you can see that how to calculate 9 plus 4. Our first step should be like that. 9 needs 1 more to make 10. As earlier, I said that first of all there has 9 boxes but if you want to make 10 boxes you need one box and that's why you you take this one box from this four so it is our first step that 9 needs one more to make 10 and that's why we can see there has a single box our step 2 is split 4 into 1 and 3. Dear students, as you know that 9 needs 1. Then how we can find that 1? To find that 1, we split this 4. We split this 4 and whenever we split this 4, we can see there has 1 and there has 3. Actually 3 plus 1 is equal to 4. That's why whenever we split 4, we can see there has 1 and there has 3. So, after that, we can take this one with that. And we can add this one with that 9 boxes. So, that is the procedure. Our step 2 is split 4 into 1 and 3. Step 3 is adding 1 from 4 with 9 and make 10. That means, whenever you split this 4, you can see there has a single 1 box. At that time, you should add this box with these 9 boxes. After that, you can see there will be 10 boxes. And it is mentioned in step number 3. And if you want to 
C in step number four you can see that remain three leaving one from four whenever you add this one with that after that there has three boxes available and that is written here that remain three leaving one from four and there has three boxes and after that our final step is 10 and 3 makes 13 that means whenever you got these 10 boxes here and also three boxes here after that your duty or your work is 10 plus 3 is equal what just calculate that and it's very easy you know that 10 plus 3 is equal 13 and you can see that's the answer of this question that means 9 plus 4 is equal 13 Dear students, now we will try to solve this question in a very easy process. So let's get started. You can see the question was like that. 9 plus 4 is equal what? So to solve this question, we will try to maintain these five steps. Our first step was 9 needs one more to make 10. That's why in the first line, the theme is like that 9 plus what is equal 10 that means if you want to turn this 9 into 10 how much you should write in that blank box and the result or the answer will be 1 that means if we add 1 with this 9 the answer will be 10 and that's our first step our second step was split 4 into 1 and 3 that means you should divide 4 into 1 and 3 and that's our next step and that's why we write this 4 is equal 1 plus 3 that means if you divide 4 into 1 and 3 it will be like that that 4 is equal 1 plus 3 our third step was adding 1 from 4 with 9 and make 10 so in this step we add this 9 with we add this 1 with this 9 so that's why 1 plus 9 is equal to 10 and it is our step number 3 4 step is or the fourth step is remain 3 leaving 1 from 4 so now we can see there has 3 which is, is still remaining that's why we add this 3 with this 10 and finally 10 plus 3 is equal to 13 the students I think you you can understand this question now but still if you have any doubts I am I am again trying to uh, deliver to my message to you so now again I am trying to uh, giving the solution of this question so uh, as earlier I mentioned that how we can find this 9 we find this 9 from there so it will be like that this 9 was come from there and this one was come from there ultimately 9 plus 1 is equal to 10 and we can see that 9 plus 1 is equal to 10 and after that this 10 is come from this 10 and this 10 is mentioned here or written here and after all we can see there has a 3 which is available or which is remain and that's why this 3 will be at this place so it is like that this tree was transferred or this tree was shifted from here to here ultimately 10 plus 3 is equal 13 and that's the solution of this question that means 9 plus 4 is equal 13 and you can see it's the result dear students actually it's a very easy question and very simple solution I think now you are able to understand uh, the question and also you are able to understand the solution but still if you have any doubts any questions any problem you can write me on the comment box I will try to solve all the problems I will try to answer all the questions which you have so dear students you know uh, irregularly we just try to upload uh, educational uh, videos from this channel so stay connected with us and try to do the classes regularly so that you can enrich your knowledge and dear students thank you very much everyone for seeing this class and stay connected with us see you later